We like to celebrate yes, we do. people on this show. Mm -hmm. Now, this viral story is causing a stir. Some people find it inspirational, others not so much. You may remember Rachel. She appeared on our show last season. Wonderful, delightful young woman who was tragically mm. paralyzed after being pushed into a pool at her bachelorette party. Well, now she's Ugh. getting a reaction on social media. Why? Because she posted lingerie pictures of herself like this. And it has created both sides saying, hey, this is great, or no, we don't like this. Join us now via Skype is Rachel. Now, Rachel, thank you for Hi, not only joining us, but something we always talk about on our show is, is celebrating yourself. And we are proud of you, because you, you were celebrating yourself with these lingerie pictures, were you not? Absolutely. Um, I mean, it wasn't just about me. Yeah, it was for me, but because I, you know, after an injury like this, you lose part of yourself. You, you at least feel like you do. And I felt like I had lost my sexual identity and I was reclaiming it here, but it wasn't just for me because there's so many other women and men in my situation who may not feel beautiful or sexy because they're now paralyzed or whatever disability or anything that they have. And I wanted to do this for them. Say, you can have something that society doesn't deem sexy and still be sexy. And you know what, even I if- I love it, I love I, it. I do too, and you, you've actually been subject to some pretty nasty commentary. Oh, I'm yeah. gonna read a couple of them. Okay. Because there, some of these comments are really mean and hurtful. One said, gross, not sexy at all. Oh. She's beautiful, but that catheter bag. People with disabilities can be attention whores also. Oh. Since when do you have to look trashy to be valuable? And to those comments, before I wanna hear what you think, Rachel, but to those comments yeah. I would say, walk a mile in your shoes and then go ahead and make the same comments. I, but what, what goes through your mind when you read those? What I have to say is like, you know, in this corner over here, we have people who were inspired, who are in my situation, who thanked me and said, I'm gonna go out and buy lingerie. You know, I feel m much better about myself because of what you did. And then you have some people over here who say, oh, that's offensive, no, we don't need to see that. But at the end of the day, I don't care about those people. I care about the people who I helped who feel better about themselves. And there should be no one feeling negative about what I did if there are people in my situation who now feel better about themselves. You go, girl, so, that's Ra right. Rachel, one real quick question. Has this changed your life? You know, because I can imagine I don't like to take pictures of myself barely in a tank top, so let alone in a bikini or or lingerie. Yeah. So how has this changed your life and made you know your intimacy? Well, level it, or it did make me feel really good because what people don't understand is that being in a wheelchair, I don't see myself ever out of the wheelchair. You have to go to a mirror to see yourself, and it becomes part of your body. And I wanted to do something where I felt like you know I'm not in the wheelchair. I just want to see myself as who I am, and for other people to see that, because I feel like a wheelchair is some, like a smoke screen sometimes. People see that and they're like, oh, I'm never gonna be attracted to that person because they're in a wheelchair. Well, this is me, this is who I am, and I'm no different in that picture than I am in the wheelchair. Woo. And I want people well, to see right. that. Yeah. Let yes. you be an inspiration to others. And, totally. and awesome. on top of this, you have even more exciting news. You have a new child. Yes, absolutely. It's something I wanted for a long time, and she's four months old now, oh. and I have my surrogate Laurel to thank. And uh, yeah, yeah, she's amazing. Oh, she's gorgeous. Well, Rachel, I love that. congratulations. Keep up all the great work, and uh, hopefully we'll see you again soon.